Chapter nine. My fun day. Now let's see how many days does each month have. I have a calendar here for you. So if we look at the calendar, which months have thirty-one days? So we look here in the first month, which is January. Yep, it's got thirty-one days. So that's January. Let's look at the next one, March. Yep, thirty-one days. So there's March. Look at April. No, May. The next one, May. Yes, thirty-one. Let's go to June, but it's not thirty-one. July. Yes, July has thirty-one. August. August has thirty-one. September. No, October. Yes. November, no, and December. Finally, yes. So we see there's January, March, May, July, August, October, and December. They all have thirty-one days in a month. Now let's look at the other ones. Which months have thirty days? So we know January has thirty-one, so we don't have to look there. February twenty-nine, no. March thirty-one, April. April here has thirty days, not May, June. If you look carefully, you'll see June here also has thirty days, not July, not August, September. September has thirty days. November also has thirty days. So we can see the months that have thirty days are April, June, September, and November. Now, what about February? February is different, right? So we look here. February has only twenty-eight days. It's the shortest month in the year. Now, sometimes February tends to have twenty-nine days. Now, this happens only once in four years. When this happens, when there are twenty-nine days in February, it's called a leap year. Now, let me show you a very easy way to remember. How many days each month has? Now, if you make a fist and look at your knuckles, this is a very easy way to remember how many days each month has. Now, the knuckles represent months with thirty-one days, and the gaps between them are those months that have either twenty-eight or thirty days. Let me show you how it works. So, if you look here, the first knuckle is Jan, which is Thirty-one days. The next one is February, which is twenty-eight days. The next knuckle is March, which is again thirty-one days. And if you go down here, the next month, which is April, is thirty days. And the next knuckle, which is again thirty-one, and the month May. And after that is June, which is thirty days. And then we have July, which is thirty-one days. So you can see so far, all the knuckles are thirty-one, and in between the knuckles, it's either twenty-eight or thirty. So let me bring in another image of a fist, just so you get a better understanding. You need to go back to the beginning, to the first knuckle of your fist. So we just ended at July. So after July, it's August. And as we know, the first knuckle, or all the knuckles, are thirty-one days. So that's August is thirty-one days. The next one is September, which is thirty days, and the next knuckle, which is thirty-one. After September, we know is October, so October has thirty-one days, and then we have November after October, which is thirty days, and after November is the last and final month of the year. Which is December, and December has thirty-one days. So you see how easy it is. You just need to look down on your knuckles, and that will help you remember the months of the year. So if we look at the calendar here, the months January, March, May, July, August, October, and December have thirty-one days, and the rest of the months, except for February, have thirty days. So while you're practicing on your fist, try and memorize the names of the months of the year. In a year, there are four different seasons. 
I'm sure you've realized the weather keeps on changing during the year. So in a year, there's spring. Now spring is when the plants begin to grow, and the days are neither too hot nor too cold. Then there's summer. Summer is when the sun shines bright and the flowers bloom. It gets too hot during the day, and one prefers to wear light cotton clothes. Autumn. Autumn is when the leaves fall. It gets a little chilly, and you need your light woolens. Then comes winter when it snows. You will need your boots, gloves, and heavy coats. This is my favorite time of the year. You can go out and make a snowman. In some countries, they also have rainy seasons. It gets cloudy, and then you need raincoats and umbrellas to cover yourself when you go out. Try and find out during which months we experience the different seasons.